welcome to iHeart Board Games, where today, Jesse, Melissa, and Joe, we're going to Llama Land. Llama! Sounds like a uh, festive place with roller coasters and uh, mascots. It's not, though. It's just, a, it's just a field full of llamas, and that's fine. This is a game from Phil Walker Harding and uh, published by some fantastic folks at Lookout Games. You may know them from such games as uh, some movie titles and uh, patchwork and stuff like that. I think they made patchwork. Melissa, correct me on that. Uh, <laughs> yeah, okay. I don't know. <laughs> Didn't think that was happening. All right, so, so this is a family <laughs> weight game. It's pretty simple. Uh, you can see that it has lots of stuff here on the table. Generally speaking, we have some goals. We have some more point cards. We got some characters. We got these little pieces of land that we're going to build other pieces of land on. We're going to make different hills of different elevation. And all the while having a bunch of llamas placed on it. So we've already decided prior to the game starting that Joe will be the first player. Joe hasn't played before. We've played. It's just been a minute. It's fine. But this game... It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. So we'll go over generally so uh, Joe can make an educated decision at the beginning. I'll have book in hand. It'll be fine. But I'm going to brief through them. Feel free to ask questions. And um, same goes for you, Joe. Feel free to ask questions. <laughs> so there's a few things you can do um, on your turn. And we'll just go through them as the, the book deems that we should go through them. Because I remember this being like, I don't like the order in this book. But we're just going to run through it. Maybe it'll make sense. So one of the things you could do is placing a land tile on your turn. Switch to this. So to do that, you take a land tile of your choice, any one of them from the top of the stack. You have five choices there. They all have five squares on each one. And you're going to either extend or build your estate. You can rotate them, you can flip them, however you want to do it. And then you're going to place it next to, uh, if you're extending, you place it next to your square. So, for example, uh, I don't want to reveal anything. Just take one from the bottom. I'll take it from the bottom. Because chances are we're never going to see that, but who knows? We can always shuffle it. It's not a problem. Well, hopefully we won't, won't remember. <laughs> anyway, that just means putting it on the bottom <laughs> as such. <laughs> Sorry. It's fine. So the things you can't do is you can't make a weird corner like that. Yep. No diagonals. I mean, that's pretty much it. As long as you got one flat end to another flat end, you're, you're good to go. Hey, time roller. Time roller. Thank you for the sub. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> 25 oh, months oh. in a row. We heart you. We heart you. All right. Do, 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 do. Meow. So. If you extend, you may then place a marker on one of these gold cards. We'll go over what all the gold cards do, but um, you can only place your marker on an empty space. If someone's already occupying it, you can't go for it. And generally speaking, what these goals are is at the end of the game, if you've achieved the goal shown, you get those points. However, if you extend at the very beginning of the game, maybe you put this here just because you plan on doing it later. But if someone's there and plans ahead of you, then, well, I guess you're not going to get the best points out of it. We'll go over what all those do in a second. So just remember, extend, then marker. Good. Great. There's some different rules in a two-player game, but we don't have to worry about that. But I remember last time we played, um, the middle spots were off limits. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But in a three-player game, we don't have to worry about that. Next up is building. Building, you take a land tile from the top, rotate it however you want to rotate it. But on this one, you're going to be placing it on top of uh, your square. And at that point, you probably have already extended it somewhat. I guess you don't have to. So there's no limit to how many levels your estate can be. You can just go for a huge tower if you want. Probably won't happen, but you never know. You can never leave gaps. So I would need multiple tiles to show that, but Feel free to ask questions when we start building, but you can't leave gaps and um, you cannot completely cover another thing. So if I had another shape like this, I couldn't just keep putting the same shape on top of another. 
so just remember it just has to line up with the ones underneath it. Don't leave gaps. And um, don't put these on top of llamas. Okay. Don't bury your llamas. Yes. <laughs> llamas go All on right. top of hills. So after that, after building, you're going to take a benefit of each icon you've covered that you've just placed. So if I place this right here, I'm covering up a little cocoa seed and a potato. So that's what I would take from the uh, resources pile over there. So you might want to look at the other side of your thing, see if it's better or worse than this, just because you know if you'll get those benefits. Yeah. I mean, I just threw it down. <laughs> I'm fine with whatever. Mine I'll make it work. Mine was better on this side than the other, so that's why I pointed out. Is it how? They're it all had, the same. They're the same. It had like the placement, like the dot, the, the mm, um, de yeah, the I design, the design of where the things are are different on both sides, and this one had a bigger mid, like a giant space. Yeah, I'll, 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 I'll switch, switch mine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> mine's diagonal. So I, I did the diagonal one. So I picked that side. Huh, neat. I got you. Yeah. Just okay, so there's it's corn, co uh, cacao, cacao, cacao. Yep. potato, coins, cacao. Um, and there's also huts. If you cover a hut, you will take a character card. We'll go over what all these do in a second, but just know you'll take one of those. And uh, before building on a turn, you can always use your foundation tiles. We start with three. You will never get more than that, though. So just keep in mind, if you want to throw a foundation on and make it legal, you can do that. But you will run into uh, your limits if you keep using them too much. Yep. Use them sparingly. Okay, so to recap, extend, place a marker. Mm -hmm. Build, collect the benefit, mm -hmm. B and B. So now, after you've done either one of those things, you can now feed a llama. These are the llamas that need to be fed here in the middle. They're looking for four corn. They're looking for four cacao. cacao. They're looking for four potatoes. Potato. Potato. The sooner you feed them, the more points, points they're worth, and they're going to gradually go down. Uh -huh. You can see here we got lucky with the corn. They're going to be worth a lot of points for a while. But um, the other, ones are pretty other ones are pretty good, but this one steadily declines. <laughs> this one declines f almost Eh, almost as fast. It's, uh, Either way, they're going to decline. One point more. You're right. So it's better. <laughs> so we just trade in trade in these resources for that? Trade in the resource you've collected that you've been covering mm -hmm. for the llamas to feed them. If you ever have 10 or more crop tokens, you must feed a llama. So you can't just sit there and hoard them. All good? Coins may be used instead of corn. Llamas accept payments as well. <laughs> it's like, so, oh, accept your money. Yeah. I'll so, go buy the corn from the market. Every two coins is a wild. So this guy will take two corns, four coins, and he's fed. He'll go buy his own corn. Yep. Or he'll give them to the farmer fellow, and the farmer fellow will go, or farmer yes. woman, farmer person will go get the corn for him or her. All right, so let's go over these character cards because these will you'll be collecting throughout the game. Um, each one can only be used once per turn. You would turn it sideways, like a like a magic card might be turned. You tap it. That's what you do. You tap it. Sorry, it's everyone's turn now. So each one does something different. You can see that this one. Um, you could trade a potato for a coin. Pay a coin from your collection to get the depicted crop, or vice versa. Oh, you pay so the crop to get a coin. Yeah. You pay the corn to get a potato, or pay the potato to get a corn. Um, this one is if you cover at least one of the coin icons when placing your land tile, you get an additional coin from supply. Um, this one is if you cover at least one of each icon, you also get two coins from the supply. So you got to, in one turn, cover three icons that are all the three different resources. It's tough. It's tough, and this one's the same as these. And we'll go over more if they happen to come out, but there's only six kinds. Doable. And we just covered like three of them. Yeah. Doable but tough. Doable but tough, yeah. So we'll we still gotta go over the scoring here, but um at the Wait, end, how do you get these? 
you covering these towns. Oh, you covered the village. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Every village. time the vi towns are covered, that's how you get those. Game end is um, if there's only one type of llama card remaining or four total land tiles. So do you think we're going to get through those land tiles? I think ours came down to the llamas. Yeah, because we're playing two player. Yeah. Because we're like, there's no way we're going to do that. Do we limit the amount we put out? It doesn't say to. You just shuffle the stacks and put them out. So it came down to that. Mm -hmm. I bet a four-player game, maybe those run out. Every llama card you've collected worth victory points. Every crop remaining in your collection for every four is worth one point. Every two remaining coins is worth a victory point. So while they are wilds, they're... Quite valuable at the end of the game. And each marker will score as well. We are playing the uh, beginner's variant. In the expert variant, they add some more gold cards, but we're just going to stick with the, I guess it's just basic variant, not even beginners, it's just normal. Because there's a beginner and there's an expert. But finally, last thing to go over is the objectives. Any questions so far? No? All right. So the ones we have out, yeah, let's go with this, uh, this, no, okay, that's pretty good. So this guy, if you have at least six llamas in your state that are not orthogonally adjacent to any edge of your state or any hole, so they want to be... One in the middle? They want to be in the middle. They don't like, they don't like cliffs. <laughs> well, where, do, where do you get the llama from? Oh, the llamas! Oh yeah. Did I we think not when go you. That? Oh right. Whenever you, whenever you buy the uh, llama, you get the llama. Oh, you pick so, up. So yeah, up I guess those. I wasn't clear on that. Um, yeah. So you feed them, and then you get a llama. When so when fed. you feed them, you add them to your uh, to your board. Okay. In fact, all they do is. Um, if you build it on top of them, then they just move on top of them. They do not. You cannot bury llamas. Oh, no, bury llamas. Okay, that's what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> Cannot bury your llama. So be be tech be a uh, tactical when it comes to placing your llama, because you're placing them. Not only will it hinder you there, but you're also placing them so you can meet goals. So uh, once again, you don't like cliffs, so keep them away as long as you have at least six. This guy, well, he's all about the uh, the roads. You have at least four llamas in the same row or column of spaces in your estate. They do not need to form a group in that row or column. So they can be on different levels and stuff like that, as shown in the picture. They just have to be in a line, either left to right, top to bottom. Next up, we have this guy. This is your Plains Llama. You must have at least four llamas on level two of your estate. We're starting off on level one. That's level two. This llama loves to walk on peaks, clearly, because that's a five there. So you want to have at least two llamas on level five of your state. Wow. Who knows if you'll even get to level five, but it's there crazy. is. Crazy. It can happen if you just go for stacks. Just go for those high peak mountains. I mean, they call step four mountains. Step five is just peaks. This purple card, guess what that is? Five of the... Have five these, character cards. Yeah, yeah. these, yeah. That's doable. Yeah. This one is have at least four potato llama cards. This four. one is four cacao cards. Correct. Llama cards. Simple, right? It's just a lot of little things here and there, but for the most part, pretty easy. So I'm going to return this little guy back to the bottom. Any questions? You're either building or extending, and when you do those things, Either you get a good, or you place a marker. When you when you extend, you can you place these next to these, like later. Like if I have that there, can I? Oh yeah, yeah. You can build keep, out. Keep going. If out. you want one level the whole time, you can do it. Okay. And be really rough on the camera, but no, you got space over there. So, so, <laughs> so the action is just to, to take. Yeah. To take on your land. turn, you are just placing a land tile. You're either extending it or you are building it. So remember, extend comes with placing a marker. And um, 
It's only checked at the end game, so. So if you don't have a marker to place out anymore, you can move one. You can move one. You can that move you've one placed. that you placed onto something else that you think you're getting better at. So like, say you choose the tower thing, but you're like, oh goodness, I'm not building towers. So you can like move it. Keep in mind, like if someone's beneath you, they won't move up. They just have to stay there until they move it themselves to take that next space. All right. Do you remember how to play now? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, I'm going to take a cacao top over here. Yeah. Or these top, whatever this is. That thing. So you're extending. Mm -hmm. right. Just remember whenever you start building, you can't put the exact shape over the other one. I mean, you can't just keep stacking one shape over another over another. It's kind of yeah. like a number nine. Yeah. Number nine specifically says you have to have two things covered. And I'll put, put my marker on the cacao card. Oh, cacao guy. Right. Your turn. My turn. Guess I should be thinking about my turn here. Right. Hmm. I'm gonna go for this one. Potato llama, please. Potato llama. All right. Looks like I get last goal, but that's why they gave me two coins. Hardly worth it. <laughs> um. Let's All right, do I think I can go for six llamas that don't like edges? I don't know about that. Just That's too build many. giant towers and put two llamas up top. And the llamas do have to go in the grass part. They can't go on the icons. Oh, that's right. You can only put the llamas in the grass. Not over yeah. the stuffs. Place it in an empty space without an icon. You have a lot of grass space mm. for llamas. Well, well, yeah, it's a llama. Um, it's a llama show tonight. I mean, I could, you've all started going for these other guys. Maybe I'll start, um, just going my own way. Oh, well, you yeah. can go your own way. I will go my own way. Yeah, go your own way. So I have built. And so I will marker. I mean, no, I've extended. Oh, no, marker. Build. Build the other B word. Bounty. <laughs> uh, uh. Buy. Benefits. Oh, benefits. Um, let's just go for... Bountiful benefits. I mean, I feel pretty good about level two. I could probably do that. Doesn't matter where they are on level two, so... Yeah, I can manage. Do it. All right, back to you, Joe. Yeah, while, while other people are taking the turn, this... You could always watch the stacks. I mean, the odds that someone take your stack is that's higher than you think, but it's also not that bad. <laughs> and I will go. Buzz. No, no buzz for me. I'll go on the people. The people. Oh yeah, five people. Yeah. Mm, yeah, that's doable. As long as you're going for town. See, I'm kind of doing that. I'm kind of surprised you went for that. But it's only 12 points. It's not too bad. Hmm. Maybe I'll go for that peak. I'm not sure about llamas. 
Yeah. <clears throat> that was the only other option. Good mama cards, or, or I could have gone. I mean, this is all that's out. There's only, what, uh, 24? No, yeah. So, I think I can manage four of them. <laughs> oh, why'd you take that? Okay. Oh, it's not a matter of getting them. It's a matter of having them in the right order at the right places. That's what I'm not sure about. Yeah. Well, this one just requires them to be somewhere. Uh, in a row. In a row. The road. All right. Well, y'all keep extending. I'm going to start building. Going for bountiful benefits. So I'm getting two corn, a potato, and a people. Two corn and a potato. So some of these guys you can use the turn you get them. Some you can't. Like these exchange guys, I believe you can. But these, the covering thing, you can't like retroactively take care of that. So, um... I'll go for this guy. Chopping corns for patatas, eh? Could be. Or patatas for corns. Maybe. Maybe. I'll go ahead and use it. Corn me. Corn, he says. Corn! Yeah. You can get those 12s. Why not? I'm done. You're not feeding up? Only have three. I mean, yeah, I could pay them off. But uh, it's not rush. No. You all have nothing. <laughs> That's true. We got a bunch of nothings around here. So. I'm good. I don't have to pay them. Pay these no good llamas. <laughs> no one. good llamas. So I get the four cacao. And I'll just take the llama cart. I didn't realize you had so much cacao under there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, I had so much cacao! He was ready. Wow. That was the... Oh, you get a llama. A llama place it in a grass field. Be choosy. <laughs> Keep in mind, you'll never be able to place a piece on top of him. Yeah, so we might want to put him where he won't get in the way. Oh, um, he's in the way everywhere. He's, <laughs> he's not part of the plan. <laughs> You show up. <laughs> We're gonna buy llamas, not to have to keep house them. You have to keep them. <laughs> All right, llama it is. All right, Melissa. That's some good cacaoing over there. No, what to do with all these llamas? Too many crazy llamas. Hmm. You should have been thinking about your turn this whole time. Oh, I know. It's just there's so many decisions to be made. It's not that many. I don't know what to do. <laughs> build or extend. That's your two, ex I know, two but decisions. What to build. What to build. I so I'll take this one. Okay. I'm going to put it here. All right. So I get a potato and a cacao. cacao. Correct. There you go. Oh, replace the character card. Oh, those are up there. Now it's, it's the covering gets... corn. Corn? He, new guy. Oh, corn guy. Corn covering. I like corn covering. 
he might be next to join my brigade. Let's go with... Um, Untap your guy. Yep. With this. We're going to place this here. And we're going to take corn guy. Corn guy? Yeah. In the future, that'll be useful. Take this one. So I'm getting a potato, a corn, and a cacao. All right. Marisa. This one? Yeah. Once a piece is picked up, no take backsies because new information is revealed. I mean, unless you want to be nice, but then. Okay, so I get hmm. a patata, a person, and a corn. Yes. So if you're a fan of Phil Walker Harding, you may recognize some things from Gingerbread House. Uh, same person I made Gingerbread House, and they also mentioned another game, Baron Park. I get a person. Because it almost takes those two games and puts them together. Okay, so I get a person. I think I want this one. And I'm going to use it right now to turn this cacao into a potato. Yeah. I can't quite feed a llama yet. It it wants more. They're not they're always going to be hungry. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to extend. Pretty sure, yeah. And then uh, let's go with. Um, Let's try this cliff thing. Should be fine. Should be good. Okay, I'm gonna take the cross one. This one? Yep. And so I get a potato, a cacao, a coin, and a person. Good stuff. You've reached level three. I'll take that, this guy. Can you use them anytime? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Let's wait. Just once per turn. Can you only do one, one to one, or can you do a bunch of one? Just once, once per turn. Okay. So a coin to a cacao, or a cacao to a coin. I'll turn the coin in for cacao right now. All right. Okay. Oh, to refill the person. More corn guy. More corn guy. <laughs> Can you use each one once per turn? So if you end up getting a bunch of people, you can use them all on the same turn. If you had two of this, would you get double the reward for doing the same? Thing? Yes. I'm gonna. Yep, two coin guys. One. So I was like, ooh, coin guy. Could be good. Do this, put it here. Uh, the people one, please. The people one. Yeah, I don't want to try to go for that giant tower person. I mean, it's kind of a tough one. Yeah, I'll just play it safe for right now. Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to feed llamas here. Oh, and I'm going to swap a cacao for a potato. And then I'm going to feed a llama. Mm. I know one that eats a lot of potatoes. Yay, this llama eats potatoes. 
Mm. Yeah. It's a potato. You come here. Right there. Or over here. Hmm. And then I get a llama. And the llama will go here. There you are, little llama. Right there. All right. I'm going to build. I'm going to cover two corns and a potato. Double corn will give me three corns and a potato. Three corns and a potato, please. That's a lot of corn. Yeah. And a potato. Um, I think I'm going to switch one of these to a potato. I'm also turning in four to get uh, a llama. Ooh, cool. baby, do you know that's that where word? Nerds of the Ooh. West. What's happening, nerds? nerds? Thanks for the raid. Give me a llama, please. Thanks for the sub. Hey, thank you Yay. for the raid. And the sub. And the sub and the Wow. Hello, nerds. This is so early for you. <laughs> It's like the afternoon, hey, isn't it? Hey, Barwin. Um, or is it super late? Hello. No, it's super hey, early. Amber. Hey, Amber. So strange. Hello, hey, all hello. Is. So we're sitting here at the table. It's Monday. Hello. This is the day that we're at the table. Yep. So right now we're playing, we're playing Llama Land. We just got through a game of Isle of Cats Explore and Draw. It's the drawing version of uh, Isle of Cats. You can watch the VOD and play along if you wanted to. But it's a good experience. Really quick review of Isle of Cats Explore and Draw. For me, it kind of replaces it. I'll miss the bits, but I'll get over it. Yeah. <laughs> We're missing all the little wooden kitties. Yeah. And this one's a Phil Walker Harding, praise be. Yep. Playing uh, Llama Land. So I just bought this, uh, or fed this llama. Llama has joined me in the fields. It's nice little tummy full of corn. Yep, it is not near the cliff. He does not like cliffs, so. No, he's don't good to put go. me next to that cliff. I'm good. So, uh, it's Joe's turn. You go ahead and tap these. But yeah, let us know what you're doing over there. Which games? Which games are ticking up your minds these days? But yeah, nerds, I mean, usually I'm used to seeing you like late, oh. late here. Mm. They're Australia, so right, now far, I'm, far west. I'll go on to the four. Uh, Mama's on a two level. Yeah, that's reasonable. <laughs> we are from far, far away from here. Oh, go to bed. Y'all's from Street Park. Oh. <laughs> I got a friend in uh, Tasmania. He's a wrestler, Tasmanian Championship Wrestling. I can't reveal his identity because he's a masked wrestler. Yes. <laughs> I think uh, it's your turn. My turn, eh? Go refresh my little person. You extended. Joe? Yeah. Did you put uh, a marker put, out? Put, yeah, I'll put the marker okay. out for him. Yeah. Is that that one at the bottom? Yeah. yeah. Okay. All right, what shall I do I'm just moving up because I'm... Going, kind of going this way. Yeah, feel free to move whatever you need to move. Whatever you want to move. I'd go for that peak if I think I can make it. I just feel like it would consume me. I wouldn't be able to do anything else. I'm going to go for this one. I'm going to put it right here so I get a corn and a person. Mm-hmm. Corn. I'm going to take this person here. Right on. And I would like to change this coin into a potato. Well, I might be in the market for extending myself. There's things I like out there, but things I don't think I can achieve. So if this were here, 
I just don't see how I could build it. Don't forget we have these little things yeah, too. Yeah, we do we have the foundation. Have three you're right. Ever. But you're right. It's it's an important thing to remember because that could be help. everything I need or everything I'm looking for. So I'm going to grab it. Why not? Let's do it. And I can always foundation that spot later. Yep. So I'm would. going to place this. I mean, it's going to be impossible to go for that <laughs> cliff, that peak. But that's what makes it so appealing to me. <laughs> Dare I try to climb the peak? <gasps> you can always put it there and move it later. I'm doing it. I got to go big. They, they got all, all the good stuff, so I got to go elsewhere. So I don't like cliffs, but I like peaks. <laughs> or my llamas. They're very confusing. They're very confusing llamas. Yeah, so I need four on level two and two on level five. Go ahead, Joe. <laughs> I'll try to make it work. I think I could do it. I see it. Let's see. Let's okay. see a board okay. game house emotes. Okay, now go on the. Oh, Amber Archer, you have your own emotes, which means you're a streamer. Ah. Oh, art stream. Mm-hmm. Art. I see art. Lots of art. I'll go on the six six llamas. Slivers, you're still around? Because uh the last one. Oh this one? Oh, okay. My turn, eh? Wanted to gauge your feelings on Lost Ark. How are you feeling about it? Get the cross one. This one? Mm -hmm. There you go. I'm going to here, so I'm going to get a coin, uh, two yeah, lots of potatoes, things. and a corn. Lots of things. Coin, two potatoes, mm -hmm. corn. Yes, sir. And I'm going to... I'm gonna it's the same designer. It is cacao, though. Like the actual resource is cacao. All right, I'm gonna use this guy to do the coin for a potato. So, coin right. for a potato. I'm gonna feed another llama. Great. Taking all the potato ones. Oh, some potato ones. All llamas. the spuds are going away. Get yourself a llama. Right. You got a road to make. That's going to be difficult. Here. No, not really. Actually, you're almost there. You got three in a row right there. Well, the one on the left can't be part of it. You got an icon in between them. Unless you fill it. You could probably fill it. Make it a level oh. two. Oh, oh, like... Oh, I see. Yeah, I'm deaf. Yeah. It, it's fine. It's fine. I'll give. I have options. Well, actually, it says it doesn't need to form a group. Doesn't need to form. I just like, it doesn't, doesn't need four in a row. Okay, you're yeah. Oh. Two more, you got it. Okay. I was like, that would have been really hard. To oh, yeah. Like manage. Yeah, you don't get a lot true. of points for that one compared no. to the other ones. Yeah. That's the lowest one for the number one spot. True. Over to me. Let's go with this guy. So I'm going to use my foundation tile. Can't have holes. Nope, no holes. And we're going to put this, um, yeah, we've got the spuds. Why not? Three spuds. Oh, getting into potato 
again, I'll turn eh? another one and get a llama. <gasps> Take him up a potato llamas. Llama, I'm, no, my <laughs> llama. Hand me another llama, please. We got a we got a lot of llamas to get. We got a lot of field to cover here. Um, because you know we're going for the the peaks here. Mm. It's it's gonna be busy. All right, llama there. And that's my turn. I could do some exchanges, but I'm not. Go ahead. I'm gonna take this one. All right. So I get two potatoes and two cacao. Sounds good. And so two potatoes. Oh, you're just gonna turn them all in? Turn it in. Don't I have to? Yeah. I'll do the cacao too. Two cacao plus the two cacao. Get yeah. I'll get another card. Oof. Can you take more than one llama in a row? Yeah, man. Hmm. Well, I couldn't have on was one quarter short. And then I'm going to take two llamas. Oh, the llamas. Oh, it says feed exactly one llama. Oh, yeah. my bad. Right. So take the corn back, or the potatoes, or whichever one. Oh, so take your potatoes. Yeah, so, yeah, I guess they that's to prevent people from just unleashing. Didn't you have more potatoes? You collected two and you had two. Yeah, sorry. Yeah, she has four. Mm. Oh, Dinner's going to get a potato. Oh, oh think of my potatoes. <laughs> what do you care? <sighs> you don't need potatoes. All right. Next. My turn, eh? Okay. Well, if you're not taking the guy that turns potatoes into cacao, I would have wouldn't be doing this. <laughs> I've been turning get potatoes and turn them into cacao. Uh, now you're stuck with potatoes. Which she took him. So <laughs> I had to get the guy that makes coins into cacao or, or cacao into coins. Nobody wants that. Nobody wants that garbage. Taking this one. So I'm getting a cacao, two potatoes, and corn. Mm hmm. So a cacao, two potatoes, and a corn. And I'm turning this cacao into a potato. You're just all about the potatoes. That's the issue with that. Um, Joe's about to get another potato. If I, there's no reason for me to go for the goal of potatoes. So there's only four, and there's corn llama. Corn llama. <gasps> You're stepping on my corn. How dare you? What else am I gonna do with four corns? Yeah, I don't blame you. <laughs> llama goes here. It's true. What What do you do? All right, um, I've been trying to work this out. The best thing for me to do, and I still can't figure it out, because I want to get to peak. <laughs> it's just so difficult. So, um, I mean, the truth is too, we need like a total of six Llamas at least. So I need to work on my resources. I need to get things out. So let's just, um, this is tough. Super tough. Let's go with, um, let's go with this. This only covers one of my fields, which isn't too bad. This is going to get me, I slightly misread that. Yeah, it should be fine. Okay, so I get a town, two spuds, and a corn. I'll trade in the spud and another spud. I'm just going to get the, this. So I'll just get a corn. I'll just take that corn. Should just skip it. 
So the spuds are taken care of, got the corn, now I need a townsperson and a llama. Llama, please. There you go. Um, yeah. Townsperson. See corn in my future. Replace him, and my turn to thaw. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna be the corn king. I'm gonna try to because no one's really going for it, unless it's by accident. It's not worth a goal, but mm, points might be the way to go. The other one are very busy markets, and we're not into that. Extending. So, so do I have to move? You don't have to. Okay. If you're happy with it, keep it. Yeah. Um, yeah. I don't. I don't. It's your reason to move off. All right. All right. Continue. Cross section, please. This one. Mm -hmm. Oh, we can I turn in potatoes for a llama then? No, that's only if you build. I think. Oh. Yeah, feeding a llama. Oh no no, you're good. Yeah, turn it in. Since I couldn't get it last time. No no, it makes sense. Yeah, after doing either one, extending or building, you can feed a llama. My bad. You just don't get benefits. Sure. Cross section, please. Cross section, little plus sign. So I'm gonna get a cacao, a potato, mm -hmm. and a coin. Nice. Oh, coin. A coin. Yeah. No corn this time. A coring. A corning. All right. Corn, coin. Oh, mm. switch. Yeah. So I'm going to trade a coin for a potato. And I'm going to trade a cacao for a potato. Hmm. Here you are, llama. Potato llama. This little llama goes right here. That is all. Get my lands together. I'm just down here. I have to shift. Um, all right. Yep, I think I did that. Okay, so I'm going to extend. Yep. I mean, I guess that's fine. Yeah, that should be fine. Okay. And then, we'll see, um, we'll see if this works. My marker needs to go out. Not potatoes, I can tell you that. I mean, you get six points for this guy, but it's hmm. corn country over there. It's corny country. Where corn is king. I could road for nine. That I'm not even confident I'm going to do. Have them in a row like that. Um, you two are already here, so I could just change my mind later. I mean, I'll have to extend to do it. But I just don't see the llamas happening, so. All right, go ahead, Joe. Okay, I'm going to take this one. And I'm getting three people. Three people! Have at it. So, you probably want to know, do they replenish? <laughs> I want to know oh, that too. Oh yeah, like if they replenish as soon as you pick oh, one up. Uh, they don't say. Here we go. Take one character card, place it face up in your collection. If you draw one from the row, replenish it by drawing a new face up one. Recover multiple huts in a turn, take the character card, refilling the row after each one. Oh, very cool. Okay. I'll take this one. And blemish. Let's cover a coin. coin. Get, get, a, get a coin, yep. Yeah. I'll take the, that one. Oh, there's a... There's a potato uh, duck. Potato. Cacao guy. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. 
um, where they get the extra cacao. Well, well, well. I'll take this. <laughs> More corn. Corn guy. Right. No feeding llamas, so I guess it's my turn. Right. Yep. I'm taking this one. Put it here so I get a coin, a potato, and a corn. All right. Coin, potato, corn. Coin, potato, corn. I'm going to trade this coin for a potato. And then I'm going to feed a potato llama. Llama llama. The four for you? Yep. Good. You met your goal. Yay! I fed all the potato llamas. Wow. And I did that goal as well. All right. Um, do you like what goals you have? Oh, you haven't even extended for a fourth time. Because yeah. <laughs> this is on second level. Yeah, you're good with the line. But you this got the road. this is on. Doesn't matter. For the road, anyway. What are you, oh, you're looking at the twos? This is second level. I'm going to put it right there. Your turns are so long that I forget what I'm going to do. <laughs> oh my. my turn was not that long. <laughs> I fed a lump. I'm pretty sure. Okay, I think I remember now. All right, I'm done. All right. So I think, I re if I recall correctly, I'm taking this. We're going to cover two corns and a coin, but there's two corns, I'm going to make it four corns and just take this. So I'll need a coin and a llama, please. Thank you. Yes. All right. So we don't want to be cliffside and we want to stay on the two. I can go over here. We scared of cliffs. And that is Don't my turn. Don't be scared turn. of the Alright, I'm going to take the, the plus. The plus. Until I get two cacao, a corn and potato. Alright. Look at the potatoes. Scoops the potatoes. And I... Covered all three. Yeah. So I get four coins. Yeah. Ooh, very nice, very nice. Get some coins. All right. So you haven't quite reached ten. I'm sure the change, coins don't have anything to I'm do with that. I'm going to change the coin into a cacao. And then feed a cacao llama. I'll feed the cacao llama. Ooh, one of one more, and you got your goal. Oh, you get luck. Mm -hmm. So, let's see these uh, estates so far. I can't really see the levels in them. You can see we're all kind of going for the goals that we, we've set up. <laughs> oh, my numbers are all in a row. In a row. I mean, that's what your goal was. Yeah. One of them. And then I already got my other one. You got your potatoes. You got your row. I need the people now. You need the people. You're not terribly far from there, though, but you've got away. a lot of town showing. And you still need to place another marker out there. You should. You don't have to. I need to. Well, I don't think I can put it I built a little spaceship or an arrowhead. At this point, I don't think I can lay anything else out without extending. I think my next, my next turn I have to extend. So be it. 
Oh, is it my turn? Mm -hmm. Oh, it's my turn. Okay. Then I'm going to do this one. I'm extending. Take this. Do you place a marker? Uh, place it on, I guess, the six llamas on the inside thing. I'm the closest I mean, to that. I got you're four. four. So far. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty good. Better get more llamas. Uh, yeah. Yep, that's it. You can't be near any holes or any cliffs. Well, I got five, six. Two more oh, spots. yeah, yeah. You're, you're good. You so, as long as you get it, the cliff? No. Yeah, no. It's just on the edges. The so, this yeah, yeah. doesn't count. Edge of your estate is what it, okay. I, I'm using the word cliff because it uh, okay. just seems like it falls yeah. into nothing. Estate, okay. If this one doesn't count, I'd have to put it there and there, which is doable if I get more llamas. All right. I'm really doubting I'm going to reach the, uh, the peak here, but uh, I guess I got to keep trying. Um, Am I allowed to put this in after I place a thing? Like if I place in something and then I put this here? What do you mean? Like that I, only goes underneath things. Say I used another one of these and I was to put that there. As long as you cover it with a piece. It's foundation. You build buildings on foundation. Yeah, I'm saying, like, if I put another one of those kind of things there and then I place it, or do I have to wait to place that, this first, then do the other stuff? It doesn't say this in the rule book, but as long as you end your turn without foundation showing, you're good. Meaning you've covered it. Okay. Like, you can't just put it out there just because you don't like to see a hole, I guess is what you're saying. No, I'm saying like if I put one of these here and this thing was here, if I could place it there in the hole. As long as you have placed a piece yeah. over it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm going to get two towns, two corns. I'm going to tap my corn boys. And we're going to grab another llama. Llama, please. And we're going to grab um, another corn boy. That's been pretty helpful for us. Replace it, please. The cowboy. We're not really into the cacao thing. We're just not crazy with it. We don't vibe with it. Um, I like those two coins for covering up all three, but you took them all. So I guess we'll go with um, guess get cowboy. And then, um, oh, I gotta put my llama down. Don't put him on the edge. Nope, he does not like the edge, and, but there's only one more place for him to go for the twos. But that will finish my twos. And I'll be one away from the six, and that, that, the other guy can go anywhere. Oh, I'm done with my twos. This is just all about the cliff thing, so it doesn't matter where it goes. Sweet. So twos are done. Good, because I was worried about that spot, actually. I'm just going to put them over here. I don't plan on putting anything down there anyway. Hmm. Thought about working on the road, but I, I'm not confident in building the road at this point. It's it's a little late. Oh wait, I have something on the road. I should probably reconsider this. Then. Um, let's go up here. Should be fine. Should be fine. Hope I don't need that. All right, Joe, go ahead. So I gotta go peak and I gotta go road. Okay, and I gotta do the sixes. Okay. So I got a person and two cacao. And 
I'll take this guy. Okay. Then I'm going to turn a, a coin into a cacao. And I turn a potato into a cacao. So that's four. A magic trick. And a llama. Yeah, no llama. Yep. Now you met your goal. Goal met. <sighs> I'm worried. I gotta meet these other goals just to keep up. And all of us are on the, the road to six llamas on the ends. A lot of potatoes. All right. My turn. We took the corn and, and the other. This one. And I'm going to put it here. So I get a person, a cow, and a corn. So remember the game ends if there's only one type of llama card or four total land tiles. Person, cacao, corn. Well, we only have the, the potato. Yeah, if two of these rows sell out. I know, if there's only one type. But I thought my yeah. one card left, one yeah. type. Left. So if the potato goes away, there'll be still two types, but after one of those go away, we'll see. I don't think I'm going to get the peak. I'm going to grab this person. Just so far away from that goal. Then I'm going to trade this cacao for a potato and then that potato for a coin. And that's it. I'll go for this. I'm going to use a foundation. Let me verify use of foundation. If you put a foundation down and have something, do you get that good? You do not. Mm. I just want to verify that uh, I can even be done. Pretty sure it can. Da -da 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 -da. Foundation stuff. There it is. Foundation tiles. Yep, they do not give their usual benefit. Makes you place your hand easier, it has to be completely covered. Cool. So I'm doing it, covering this coin thing, but don't get the coin. What I am covering though is, you guessed it. Corn! Two corns. More corn! So I'm gonna tap my boys. Gosh, I'm gonna get so five corns. corns. So four will be spent here. So I'll take a llama and a corn, please. Yep, we are all about that corn, about that corn. Um, corn llama. So this guy can finish the six. I can just put him down here and then my six is done. Then I can worry about the line later. Because, yeah, I have, just verifying I have the twos done. Yep, four on two. Okay, I'm going to just finish the six. That's worth more points. All right. And um, that's my turn. Ooh, extending this late in the game. Will you be moving a token? Uh, no. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> All right. Oh, person. you're almost ready to go for a peek. <laughs> I mean, I'm only on level three. It's I don't see the peak happening. <laughs> I got the four. That's yeah, where I'm like, yeah, there's no way to get a five up that way. It has to be up. Yeah. I mean, they they all have two grasslands on it. So once you get the five, you're just got to cover it. So 
I don't know. I just have, I mean, I've got, I mean, all, all the way down to one on this side, so there's no way to put Yeah, you got to have at least I two things fill, next yeah, to it. Yeah, fill up all the way to three on. on. That's tough. Uh, it's your first game. Oh, where's your foundations? Okay, you still have them. Yeah. So you could put a plus piece on top of that whole thing with the foundation over the cocoa. Oh, you mean over here? Yeah, because then you're not covering mm -hmm. one piece. Like, you, you've you got a spread going on. I think uh, that's legal. Yeah. Okay. Well, move me over to the, from the... From oh, the, you want to do it? From the six or the... Uh, you might be kind of close to the that. The four on the two. That. Because I'm, be I'm, I'm not doing that one. Yeah, I'm those two you're done. done with. Yeah, that makes sense. I'll try this one. More points, too. I think it's, yeah, I think that's legit to go for. Okay. My turn, hey? Eh? Yep. I'm using one of my little foundations here, but mm -hmm. not getting the potato. Sure. Just want to fill the hole. And then I'm getting the, this T shape. Have you played Gingerbread House? Mm -hmm. Okay. There's I'm putting similar things going here. on. Here. So I'm getting two people, a corn, and a cacao. Cool. Oh, I think you need people, right? Yeah, two people, corn, and cacao. So two people. Mm hmm. And I'm going to take. Hmm. The potato guy. Now refill. The potato guy. Oh, refill the man. Character cards. Yeah. Or woman's. True. And I'll take this one. And now I'm going to switch this cow into a coin. Mm hmm. So I cover two towns, but do I just get one coin? You get one coin for activating that guy. Yeah. So right now I'm getting two coins. I'm switching this for a coin, and then I'm getting a coin I'll double for, check my, for, you, though. for my thing. Because I, I only have one of them. Yeah. If you cover at least one hut, get a coin. Yeah. You cover it at least one hut. Now I'm going to spend two of these coins and... Three corns to get a llama. Stepping on my corn. How dare you. Corn llama. And the llama goes here. You're done? Oi? Yep. All right. Yep, yep. All right, this guy is going to go here. Covering up four cacao and a potato. I will collect the cacao, cacao, this llama. So I need one cacao, one llama, one potato, please. Thank you. Oh, we're running low on llamas. It's fine. I think I can go ahead and make my road go here. Yeah, I'm trying to get myself a llama every turn. Go ahead. It's the only way I could think I can keep up. You've got a lot of llamas over there. Okay, I'm gonna put the... Yep, plus shape. Plus shape. You got your peak. Just need to fill it with llamas now. So I get a corn, a person, and a potato. Corn and potatoes. And I'll take this one. And I'll turn a potato into a cacao. Probably could have worked this out better. 
After the advice I gave you, I didn't take my own advice. Um, whoops. Because I should have grabbed the T-shape as well. <laughs> Did the exact same thing oh, yeah. to yeah. get my peak. It's going to take It's hard to remember because you want to go, I'm going to need to save these. And then you're, you're, no. You're like, oh, no. Yeah. Whoops. That's fine. I'm just worried I'm not going to get two guys up there. I'm going to get like maybe one. Maybe not even. Oof, it's gonna be tough. Such a hard goal. I got my road, I got my six, got my level twos. All right, it's Melissa's turn. Thinky McThinkerson. Can you use more than one of these in a round or just one? <coughs> Legit question. Place any number of your remaining foundation tiles in your estate. Boy, I wish I had more than one. And I'd really be building my peak. Yeah, that's gonna be. Oh, replace the people, please. I see. I see a mistake I made. I shouldn't have turned in the, the cow. Okay, okay, so if I put this here, should have waited. Then I can go one, two, one, two, one. Right? Is that one, two, one, two? <laughs> I don't know yeah. what you're talking about. All right, you picked it up. It's finalized. Right here. It looks like, put this yeah. here. It's your level, what? Uh, four? Three. Thing. No, it's going to be a four. Oh. All right, so I get a potato, a corn, and a, corn. And a coin. Potato, corn, coin. Hmm. I need a two potato to cover. That doesn't work. Um, hmm. Should I give up the 18 points and go for six? Because <laughs> I have the five character cards. I don't know. Potato into coin. Hmm, hmm, hmm. What's your status? I think that's all I do right now. Great. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I need two foundations. <sighs> Why didn't I take my own advice? Um, guess I'll be placing this. Let's go with um, here. I get a corn and a coin and a person. Thank you. And then um, the person. Let's go with um, this guy. All right, Joe. Crazy tricks you're doing. All right. Get this one. It goes here. And so I'm covering up a potato, a coin, a cacao. Uh-huh. That's a lot of coins for you. So I get a coin. Yeah. Cover another coin and get a coin for the card, for the person. 
And I get four coins for the... Covering up all those, yeah. Keep in mind those are worth points at the end, unless you just trade them in right now, which you probably will. <laughs> and then I get... Every two is a victory a point. potato, a cacao, and a corn. So if you ever have over ten crop things, you have to turn them in, but I don't think you have that, so... I got four coin. Corn. All right. So I take that I'm going to put, put the llama and I'm going to put him up here. Are you going to get another one though? I mean, yeah, you got the coin for it, I guess. But this game could end if she buys potato and I buy corn, for example. Yeah, that's why I bought the... Because <laughs> y'all can't buy it. Y'all don't have enough for cacao. For cacao? I mean, y'all, you probably exchange for... You could probably... For the cacao llama... Oh, yeah. Yeah, you would have to exchange. You would have to. She doesn't have a way to get, unless she builds something, she might get it. So. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I don't know. So, I'm just saying the game could end before your turn because you're. First yeah, no, I mean, I, I took that in in the count. You had to, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So that's why I was taking the corn one. You had to. I mean, they're Ooh. same same value, so. I mean, I have corn. I think I'll yeah. I have cacao if I cover up the right things, so. Yeah. Mm. But I can only buy one. What I'm saying is, you may not be able to buy a, a potato one. I think. What I'm doing. You know what you're doing? This one. Alright. And I can go right here. Great. Yeah. And that's two potato and a cacao. You going for a peak? You don't even have a peak thing. No, no. Two potato and All a right. cacao. Now I have the card that says if I cover up two potato, mm -hmm. I get an additional potato. Go for it. Okay. And that's three potato and two coins, which gives me this potato llama. Mm -hmm. Bye bye, corn. I blocked you from getting peak points. And then this. That might be worth it. <laughs> if I buy the corn one. Yeah. Yeah. This little llama goes here. Bring me out and I'm getting peak points. Like. Neither of us will, <laughs> because we gotta have two on the peak. And I think uh, I just finished all my goals. Five people, great. four potato llamas, six in the center. One, two, three, four, five, six without touching great. edges, and four in a row. Good for you! Yay! Goals that was complete. Your goal. well, I guess the question for me is: Do I believe? I could achieve this. I'm going to twice. change this cacao into a coin. And my turn is done. Because if I let it keep going, I could get peak points as well, which is three more. I think I'm going to let it keep going. So we're going to grab. Yeah, we're going to grab this one. We're going to put this right here, which fetches a potato, a corn. I'll take the potato and corn, but leave the cacao because I'm just going to buy this guy. So potato, corn, and llama, please. Potato, corn, llama. Yeah. So knowing that potatoes are gone. No more potatoes. I mean, I already have the four corn, so it doesn't really matter that much. Um, but I need to start preparing maybe for other crops. Um, yeah, so it's going to be one of our peak guys. Um, Potatoes are useless right now. Useless potatoes. Useless potatoes. But it doesn't really matter that I have it, so I think I'll just say done. Go ahead, Joe. The power is yours. I'm going to put this here. And then I'll turn in. I mean, I think I'm okay still. Just letting it go another round. I'll turn it 
turn in a potato for a cacao. Mm -hmm. This is definitely the last round, though. And then I'll turn in two coins for a while for a cacao. To pick up another cacao llama. Oh, or cacao llama. And I get a llama. Okay, I but thought you might go for the more points. So. Put that there. Yeah. Well, I had to put an edge to get my. The, he was going to be on the cliff. Wait, what? I was going to put a llama here. I need the six that's not on an edge, right? The six. Oh, yeah. The llamas? Oh, yeah, yeah. So I put that there. You just put that there? Mm -hmm. Oh, oh, you extended. I okay. extended so that he wouldn't be. Yeah, because you already had the resources to. Uh, yeah, I had. To, I, had to I didn't it. need to build anything. To, to yeah, that makes sense. Just, uh, just, I mean, plus I don't know if there's a place I could put something right now anyway. Without. Two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, you're good on that. You're good there. You're good there. You're good there. Yeah, you got all your things. Sweet. All right, Melissa. Since you already achieved achieved all your goals, I guess getting coins could be a way to. Earn some more points or buying a llama. Every two coins is worth a point. Yeah, I just can't see anywhere I can build something is the problem. I don't have enough flat surfaces and I only have one of these left. So even if I was to oh, put to it collect yeah, to collect anything. Oh yeah, you're <laughs> I'm pretty tapped out. You got a pretty small I thought there. that last round was the last round, so No, no. Um, I wanted to let it go because I can get the goal too and I net three more points. Because I'm worried about you too, so I gotta get the points I can get. I didn't get them in on the, the fancy four llamas. That's getting points for earning points. <laughs> it's pretty good. I had to go all the other route. Yeah, I don't think there's anywhere I could put this and actually build something. No, because you need five spaces. Everything yeah, you have three. is three. Yeah, there's... So you're extending. And I really doubt you have any desire to move any of these things. Um, nope. How's your level two? Not so great. Right here, right here. Oh, you have four. Well, it's actually worth it to you to move them. No, this is not a level two, is it? Is oh, it? that's level three. Never mind. One, two, you only have three. three. Well, never mind. I was going to say move your character thing yeah, to the twos have... and you would have got three more points. Yeah, I only have three of them. Go for these coins. These are level ones. These are level threes. These are level twos. Oh, you can't even go for coins. Well, then just extend and call it a day. There you go. You're not moving a marker. You're not? This here. What? Just for completeness. Just for completeness. So I don't you have can't, a hole. That's an illegal move. What? What? It's an illegal move. You can't have foundation showing at the end of your turn. I told you that. <laughs> Very for incompleteness. <laughs> yeah. Fine. I'm putting this back. It's, the, it's the last one. So there's nothing <gasps> you revealed. You can't take back. There's these. nothing revealed. It's the last one. And you're ending Fine. it. Fine. Then I'll just do this. Now you're now, now it's done. Go. What's the difference? This makes no difference. No holes. Sure, she just wanted all corn chunks. That wasn't even she a hole. Almost, she has almost all corn yeah. chunks. That wasn't even an actual hole. If you flipped it around facing your place, it would have been a hole. That was just an edge. Yeah. This is more complicated. All right, my turn. I'm so glad your turn took way longer, <laughs> and it was nothing to do. Yay. <laughs> um. All right. So I also don't need to place, but I may as well because. Resources are worth points, so. I don't have anything to turn corn into coins. So. We'll take what she almost took. I need a potato, a cacao, and a coin, please. Turning in four corns. Corn got us where uh, we are, so we're going to stick with corn. Could have done cacao as well but that would have cost me coins. Uh, oh, llama, please. My final peak. Peak llama. So, Joe was the first player. That marks the end of the game because it was triggered based on how many llamas were left. There's only one type of llama card left. End of play is triggered. Play until we've all had an equal amount of turns. We have. Um, 
If the end is triggered on the turn of the player to the right of the start player, which would be me, the game ends immediately, which makes sense. We're all taking the same amount of turns. Let's determine our scores. There's a little pad for us. There is. I'll get my oh, wait, pen. there's a ton of things over here. I mean, okay. Any, just one. I don't care about the color or anything. Just something that writes. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So mine. Uh, I should go in turn order, actually. Joe, Melissa, Jesse. All right. Last looks at our enormous palaces we've built. All right. So the first thing we're going to count each llama card is worth the listed amount of victory points. Make sure you keep them for step, step four, though. We're just counting them for now. Counting, counting, counting. This is not mine. All right, Joe, what you got? 64. 64 and llamas? Yeah. Jeez. Whoa. What is that? That's a 15, 31, 41, 52, 64. You got all the big llamas. Apparently. <laughs> yeah, that's what happened. 60, how much? 64. Oh. I didn't think I'd have as much because you'll have more llamas. Jeez. Yeah, we had more llamas. There. I had little small Useless llamas. Ones. Oh. <laughs> What'd you get? I was like, I was like, man, they have more cards than I do. So this is 8, 9, 10, 10, 20. This we is have to 20, recount, but it's, I didn't get anywhere near that. Like 20, 39, 40, 50, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 60, 61. 61? Okay, hold up. <laughs> yeah, you, you got like... I miscounted. Yeah. Uh, 10, 30... 40, 50, okay, yeah, I miscounted. I put 47 for some reason. So that's 50. Yeah, I was like, yeah, way more. Uh, 60, 70, 82. Okay. Yeah, that's why I thought you had about 80 something points. Okay, I don't know why I counted so little. You I think what it like is, half, I put them aside. Like and half of them, and then you count the next half of <laughs> yeah. them, too, and, and that's two. when I stopped, yeah, okay. That's why I was like, what, I was like, what? Yeah, I was like, what are you, okay. Yeah, because you have bad. like, yeah, I mean, just these 10, yeah. 20, 30. I know what I did. I counted these as tens for some reason. I saw the one in there. Oh, you tied them together. Okay. I blanked. Uh, each crop remaining in your collection is worth a victory point. Each crop? Each crop. Yeah. I don't know why I kind of said that wrong, too. I thought, because the image says, oh, it does say four. So, yeah, each crop is worth one. Would you have done anything differently? I probably no. I had, to, I had to. I had to do this because I have all these coins. I would have just spent those. Oh, I would have converted coins into crops, probably. Yeah. Well, if it's a close game, we'll uh, remath yeah, a little it, bit. I don't think oh, because like, I would have. Maybe if it's turned. a close game, we'll remath a little bit. Yeah. I don't think it will be though. All right, so I get five points for crops. Crop points. You got one, right? I don't have any. Mm, okay, so coins, um, for every two, it's worth a point. So I have three points. Three? Mm -hmm. uh, if you have an odd number, I could put point 0.5 or whatever. One point. One point. Because it says half times. So that's 2.5 for me. But I'm just... I know so much llama. And Joe, you had uh, three? All right, finally, each marker on an objective card will be scored. We've already decided that everyone got everything, right? Yeah, I got my four potato, five people. Everything. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we're, we're good. Two, three, four, five, six, yeah. Four, All right, so um, I'll just count, Joe, you're blue, right? No. Teal. 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 So 15. Yeah, double check my math because it's off today. So 30, 45, mm -hmm. 57. 57. Melissa, 24, 33, 48. 
That look right? Mm-hmm. Ooh, I got the three at the top. Um, oh, you put three out? Oh, no, I say I have three at the top. I have four out. Oh. Up here. So this is 27 plus more plus 33. 27 plus 33, that's 60. Double check my math. Yeah, 30. 30. All right. Now, calculator. Well, I was just going to get Siri. Hey, Siri. What is 64 plus 3 plus 57? 24. <coughs> For Joe. What is 61 plus 2 plus 48? 111 for Melissa. What is 82 plus 5 plus 2 plus 60? 149. I don't think we need to remath any of the, uh, yeah. <laughs> the uh, little things. But yeah, that's the final scores.